and you're welcome back so i saw that she tweeted earlier she was stuck in traffic and easily gone i come from there every morning so i know what it's like in fact i don't leave the house anytime after 6 a.m you know or before or 10 a.m yeah mm -hmm. anyway she made it sister debbie made it uh good morning. good morning so how did you make it what traffic was slow this morning well I don't know. For some reason, I decided to use like the Oponglo side. Yes. And I decided to use that because there's like three, okay, four lanes. that was wise. Three lanes. Yes, yes, uh -huh. yes, so I'm like, wise. if anything, cra, it yeah. go move. Uh -huh. And I was in traffic. Luckily, there were policemen to direct. Okay. Even though so the traffic lights sanity. were working. There was, ah, some sanity. there was some sanity. And then when I got to 37, like Golden Tulip side, it yeah. was all free. So yeah. I was lucky. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, you know, I remember listening to Uncle Obama. When I first heard the title, I was wondering like, what Ahoshi oh, is. Is she trying to get to Obama's <laughs> attention? And then I heard everything about um, you know monkeys and bananas and wh why did you write that? What's wh what inspired that one? <laughs> well, at the time I wrote the song, um, Obama had become a very popular name, yeah. especially in Africa, yeah. because of the um, affiliation with the president of the United States yes. or the campaigning president of the United States at yeah. that time. Actually, he won. No, I wrote the song before that, anyway. Well, it had become a popular name. Yeah. Um, and then we were just proud of the fact that, oh, an African is running for presidency in the United mm. States. So there was Obama Hotel, Obama Toffee. Yes, I know Obama Hotel. Things yeah. like that. So that's what inspired the name. And the whole song was inspired by my pet monkey. I used to have a pet monkey called okay. Kiko Breezy. I would want one, a monkey for a pet. Yeah, but yeah. if you want him to stay in the house, you have to wear diapers for him. For him. Yes. Okay. You can't train monkeys to indoors to poo and pee okay yeah. i see so he yeah. can't say indoors he's got to yeah if he's indoors okay. you have to make sure it's not his poo -poo in time. yeah or his yeah or it's in his cage no but so yeah and and and, yeah. and 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 uncle obama the uncle obama you wrote about likes bananas no 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 he sells bananas at the market okay so um you know how in ghana to show respect to someone yeah. older than you especially yeah. you don't just call them by their yeah, name you so add uncle. uncle or auntie okay the same way you have to show respect when you're calling me so Where, you where's add, that pet you have to add that sister. inspired this oh he's he song. grew it's so like, big uh, and then he yes we like we're keeping him at our friend's place in uh. ahenia and then one day he escaped yeah so yeah. he's gone now sadly but um yeah. But um, my video director, Prince Doblo, has a new pet monkey. She's called Zara. Zara. So I'll be a hunching on her. I see. Pretty and then soon. We'll be I'm going to play on her. You know, Zara's play with love her. For, for bananas. How yes, about you? Yes, you yes. like bananas? Um, yeah, I, I prefer local bananas. Yeah, me too. I like yeah. them very, when they're very hard. Um, but I, now with I the like whole green. GMO thing, I'm, I'm even worried for our local bananas. Oh, no, no, there's still, there's still re really good local bananas. Organic yes, ones. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, okay. Still really good local yeah, yeah I, be, I believe in that. And, <laughs> yeah. and then there's, there's, there's Ghana Jollof. Mm -hmm. I absolutely love that, you know, because... Thank you. Again, I'm, I'm in a position to say this, and mm -hmm. I say this with all authority. Your restaurant. I, yes, and mm -hmm. I, I, I prepare Nigerian cuisine all the time, and I know what goes into the preparation of Nigerian Jollof and Ghana Jollof. And so I can tell do you, you that to, Ghana, Do you want to testify? Ghana, we have a few minutes. I could do that if you don't mind me using your time. Girl, um, don't use my time. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, but it's Ghana Jollof, isn't it? Why, why yes. did you write that? You okay. capitalized on that thing on Twitter, on the feud. Yeah, I, I didn't really, I haven't yet really capitalized. Oh, I see. It, yeah. There was a few but, on, on... Oh, of course, yes. of course. Sorry. Yeah, that inspired it. So yeah. one of the main things that inspired it was Princess Vitara's song called Nigerian P-U-S-S-Y. P-U-S-S-Y, yeah. P-U-S-S-Y. Um, yes. She okay. did that song a few months Can ago. Can I add cut? No, no, no. So this it one, there's no, sense. This like one, a, there's no okay. cut. So this one, it makes sense. It's Don't just, worry. All right. When you write it, it makes sense. <laughs> anyway, so she released the song with a video. Yeah. And quite a number of people, including Ifia, sent messages to One Love saying, oh, I think Debbie should do the response. Oh. I'm like, why me? What are you guys trying to say? Yes. So um, they kept insisting that I do a response. And at that time, the, the teasing was happening. The eternal Jollof yes. was on social media yes. was happening. So I'm like, you know what? Let me do a song, but I'm going to talk about Jollof. So I'm going to call it Ghana Jollof. Yeah. And then one of the men saw where they were excited. They like, yeah, it. let's do I this. I absolutely <laughs> love it. So it's so, basically just teasing. Yeah. yeah. So who wrote that? I wrote it together with One Love. Yeah. I write most of my songs together with, with him. With him. Yes. I see. He, mm -hmm. he's, he's a phenomenal songwriter. Yes, he yeah. is. He is. Yeah. He's, I, I like to call him a genius. And, and <laughs> then I also saw something about you and one medical. Medical yes, doctor. Like your medical doctor. Yeah. He checks. He's a gynae. He checks on you like. He's not a gynae. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's a GP, <laughs> general practitioner. practitioner. Okay, yeah, but medical. <laughs> so medical is a rapper. Yeah, he's part of AMG Business, Arab. 
money gang business. <laughs> That's a label. No, I was trying to remember what it stands for. Because <laughs> I used to think... But you're that, seeing him, long and short. Of yeah, yeah, we are together. What's, what's in him that you like? What's, what, what's about well, him? Well, it was love at first sight. Does we nothing met, exist? Sorry, it's, it does. It does? Yeah, it does. Yeah. How do you know it's love when you first see him? Well, after kissing many frogs, you know when you found your prince. Your prince, I know. And he doesn't. No, have I don't know because I don't kiss <laughs> frogs. <laughs> Sorry, shade. <laughs> okay, so he's very. Um, he has a good heart. He's very open-minded. Truth be told, the good heart is all that matters. He has a good heart. He doesn't wait for you to ask for anything. It's not like you're supposed to ask, but he gives before you ask. Okay, I like me liking that part. Exactly. Yes. Girl, that's the key. <gasps> he has a very part. good heart. He's talented. He's um he's smart. He loyal. He's smart. <laughs> I like he's all yours. Oh, I'm in not, other words. I'm not saying that I don't like no, to it's like okay. it take possession I'm not of what belongs to people, you. There's nothing but wrong I really with that. admire him. Yeah. And um, we make each other happy. We're always joking and yeah. laughing. So soulmates. Yes. A match made I in heaven. So. Oh. A match made in soul too. <laughs> That's where he's from. So, okay. <laughs> so, what, 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 what does the future hold for um, Sister Debbie? I recall seeing a video shoot. Mm -hmm. No, in fact, it was a photo shoot. Mm. And I think that you have this mermaid concept. So, I saw that you were you were nude, you know, from waist up. Yes. And then yeah. you have some things tied around you. Okay, so down. one of my favorite photographers, yeah. his brand is called Lightsville Photography. He's called Neokai. He came up with this concept about belts, and he named it Bellet. Okay. Showing the different uses of bellets or belts okay. in our society. So he, he had different concepts. Mine was just to show design. Mm. And he had one where he wrapped one love and mensa in belts to show togetherness, unity. And he had one where a model was just wrapped in belts to show her shape. So it's like we use belts, you, like you've used this belt yeah. to maybe accentuate your curves. Right. Yeah. You've also maybe used it to like add a touch of design to your outfit yes. to make it pop. So he's basically showing the different ways that belts are used. Does, because does I'm the African mermaid, yeah. I had to have a tail. I like that. Does he inspire the, the, the nudity we've seen you um, portray? Who? In That's who your, your, your photographer. You oh, mentioned no. he inspired that concept, the mermaid concept. No, no, he came up he... with that concept. Yes. No, he's not the one that I did my nude shoots with. Okay. That's boudoir photography. That was with a different oh, photographer. Okay. He, I'm for Connolly, he decided to do boudoir in Ghana because not a lot of people are doing it okay. and doing it classy and okay. tasteful. Boudoir so. is French for like bedroom or some Perfect. intimate place. Yes, exactly. That. So that's yeah. it. Yeah. Um, yeah. I think my body just inspired You love. know, I'm, I'm telling you, I, sometimes I can't castigate people who, you know, like, will do, I'm thinking if I had a flat tummy and I had, I had, I, I didn't have any, you know, um, what do they call that, speed ramps? And love all, I probably would have, yes. Just call them love I call handles. them speed They're ramps. Good. Because they impede the speed. When oh you're no, girl, <laughs> they are good for. All you right, know. thank you so much, Sister Debbie. <laughs> you're um, welcome. Final words. Anything you want to say quickly? Um, I'm coming out with a song, yeah. a hip hop track with Medical called yeah. Enemies. Yeah. And then me, Ochami Kwame, Medical and Kaboom, on a song together, nice. hip hop. And then I'll be doing some acting. I see. Movies. Come TV back. Let's talk about that. Time. Sure. Come back sure. in this talk. Okay. All right. So that's it. Thank you so much, Sister Green is so good on you. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> And that's it for a new day this morning.